The simplicity of this is ordinary. The simplicity of this. The simplicity of this. It's not complicated. It's not hidden. It's not waiting. It has no expectations or demands. It just is already that way. This way. The simplicity of this. The simplicity of this. The the recognition we're talking about of the simplicity of this is ordinary. The expectation of the individual is that something extraordinary or special has to happen. That freedom is truly somewhere else, and that the way things are is somehow incomplete. That something needs to change for the freedom to be as it is. So the simplicity of this is missed by the expectation or the need for it to become something else. Something else. Something else. That one shouldn't have certain emotions or certain feelings. That there's a certain way of being that's correct and a certain way of being that's incorrect. That's all tied up with the feeling that this isn't it, with the arising of a separate experience called I am, which is a sense of incompleteness. The sense of something needing to happen. Needing to happen. Needing to happen. That sense of incompleteness is really the sense that something's really happening. It sort of pulls the entire appearance into into a solid continuum called my life. There isn't anything called my life. There just isn't. There isn't anyone that has a life. Has a life. Has a life. There's an apparent past. An apparent future, and this is also apparent, and those are all just simply what is. But it's not real. It's not solid. It's not substantial. It's not fixed. It's completely unhinged. It's wild. It's wild. It's insubstantial. Can't be held on to. Be held on to. Be held on to. The idea, the experience of the individual is that it has a central, organizing principle. It's the one in charge, but that's truly just a dream. That is also this insubstantiality appearing as I'm hearing as I'm hearing as I'm. So from here, there's absolutely no expectation or need for that to go away because it's not really happening anyway. Nothing really is. This is already unconditionally free, and it's not for anyone. It just simply is that way. What is is already free. Not for anyone, not about anything, not for any reason. It's not in relationship. The freedom we're talking about isn't in relationship to anything that's going on. Going on. Going on. It is everything that seems to be happening, and that's already the case. So there's truly no need. No need. The need to find it is just part of the illusory experience that it could possibly be lost. And in that sense, there's no right way. Or wrong way, or good, or bad. It's all already the freedom that's unconditional. It's this. That's not a feeling. It's not for you. It just is. It just is. It just is already that. And there really isn't anything else to say. It's not complicated. It's not hidden. It's not waiting. It has no expectations or demands. It just is already that way. This way.